Hey everybody, it's Damon with Incap Store and Pad Life, and this is a quick clip on how to operate a rotary. Uh, we've had a number of people buy swirlies recently, they love the machines, but some people are not used to uh, rotary action. So basically when you're using a rotary, it's um, a wheels up. So the machine's gonna spin in a circle, right? It's very simple. And you're gonna use the handle here uh, to move the machine, okay? You don't wanna control a rotary. It's not, it's impossible. What you gotta do is pretty much move with it and guide it. So what's gonna happen is our friend Spencer from Abercrate Abra Carpet Cleaning here in Las Vegas is going to operate the machine. And you'll notice that what he's gonna do is he's gonna have it waist high, like he does right now. He has it uh, locked in place on the pin handle. If you have a different type of rotary, it'll be a foot lever uh, or maybe a cable release. You'll lock it with your foot or with your hand. In this case, we use the uh, knob lever, very convenient. You put it into a place where it's comfortable with him. Again, about waist height. And then uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn the machine on here and there's gonna be a little bit of torque on it from the beginning. That's because the motor on the swirly, it's, uh, it's a little stronger, has a little more torque than some, but that's better by design for resistant surfaces like carpet. So it's gonna kick off a little bit, but then what he's gonna do is when he wants to move it to the right, he's gonna lift the handle up gently. And when he wants to move it to the left, He's going to just push it down gently. And when he wants to hover or stay in place, he'll keep it around waist height. Again, where he is now, that's Spencer. So again, do not control the machine. You want to almost flow with the machine. It's almost a Zen-like sort of operation. It's the only way I can describe it. Also, I want to recommend that when you try this, don't try it in your home. Um, either try it in a very empty space in your home or a vacant home or what have you. Uh, or more importantly, try it um, in your uh, in, in a garage or what we're doing here out in front of the headquarters here out on the open concrete uh, very very safe place we just have a fiber pad under here and uh, here we go we're gonna start it up so you can see he's not moving it at all he's not moving the handle at all and it's essentially in place so now he's gonna lift it slightly he's going to the right you can see the movement here by how much dust we're <laughs> removing here so again he's moving it just slightly to the right and a little down to the left. So upright, down left. And you can control if he wants that to go slower. See? And then he can go faster just by moving it up quickly or dropping it quickly. So fast or slow. But we do recommend kind of going at a slower pace as a rule of thumb, like he is right now, especially when you're cleaning. So again, he's gonna to go to the right, he's gonna go up just a little bit. He's doing it one-handed now. He's going down to the left. Up right, down left. And you too one day can do it one-handed just like Spencer. But not when you're starting. Definitely two hands on the handle. And again, practice, practice, practice. It's about a five minute exercise. Once you learn how to do it, you learn how to do it for life. It's like riding a bicycle even easier much easier so thanks for watching i hope this gives you some help um, on how to operate a rotary and in this case we're looking at the swirly in particular you can always visit us online at incapstore.com or call us at 866-974-0202 uh, or send us an email at info at incapstore.com or join the conversation online at padlife on facebook thanks for watching